University of Texas Systems and community members gather at the Regional Academic Health Center in Harlingen for the unveiling of the University of Texas Rio Grande Valley Smart Hospital, May 28th. The Smart Hospital will offer training to students from the middle school level up to the medical school level with its state-of-the-art facility. The Smart Hospital will offer animatronic mannequins, not just for CPR training, but also to simulate seizure patients, take care of newborn babies, and to help train students on basic human care. The simulation at the Smart Hospital were demonstrated by student volunteers from the Harlingen Consolidated Independent School District, who also talked to the mannequins about their symptoms to help make the simulation feel real. It is a gift um, to the medical school and to the community, and I mean broadly speaking, not just health professionals, uh, that is an enormous lure to be able to do beyond training uh, all the collaborative ventures that exist with industry, businesses, the training community, but the training community broadly speaking, like for example, maintenance of certification, maintenance of licensure. So it is an and, it opens opportunities even for binational training, especially with, all, with the virtual network that Dr. McCormick has developed. You can really go live, not just through the valley, but throughout rural Texas and across the board. The simulation hospital was designed and built using $10 million in funds from the University of Texas System Board of Regents. The hospital demonstrated various situations, including emergency calls with real humans reenacting a car crash, a gunshot victim, and a head trauma victim, with real emergency medical technicians to help the students throughout the process. So I, I do think that that's, just think of it as an incredible opportunity to have an impact on the community by bringing this focus in, um, into, look, this could be you. You may have un poquitico, a touch of diabetes now, um, or it could be you are pre-diabetic, but it's a great opportunity to be able to have an impact, even in patient education. You know, I, I think that all of that is for the purposes of dual purposes, of not only training the professionals, and I mean that broadly beyond medicine, but also an incredible opportunity that's offered for the purposes of community education as well as prevention. And I think that has to be, that has to be in the forefront. So whether it's in the area of nutrition or obesity, which is what the Institute is going to be focused on with the School of Medicine. To learn more about the University of Texas Rio Grande Valley, visit the link in the description below. For more news around campus or around the RGV, subscribe to the Pan American YouTube channel, like us on Facebook, and follow us on Twitter. For the Pan American, I'm Michael Aguilar.